What is the best way to treat osteoporosis? So this is an answer to a previous video I did about osteoporosis and how serious of a disorder it is uh, because I treat people with pathologic fractures almost weekly in my practice. So the most important thing when it comes to osteoporosis is prevention. Prevention is super, super important to not let your body get to that point because once you're there, it's very difficult to recover from that. So the first thing is preventing osteoporosis is resistance training at least three days a week. And this is because the bones don't increase their density unless you tell it to. So even if you take appropriate nutritional supplementation, your bones aren't gonna get thicker unless it feels a load that you're placing on it. And it's particularly important to do in the lower extremities and the spine, but also in the upper extremities. So the areas that you have to be concerned about with osteoporosis are hip fracture, compression fractures in the spine, and then fractures of the distal radius and the proximal humerus from, from falls, basically. So super critically important that if you're over 45 years old, men and especially women, to be engaging in at least three days a week of resistance training. The next thing is you want to include nutritional supplementation. I'd recommend calcium, about 1,200 milligrams per day. I also strongly recommend vitamin D. I take five to 15,000 uh, I use per day, and I get my vitamin D checked twice a year. And that's the amount that I have to take to keep a high range of vitamin D. But I'd say at least two to 5,000 per day. You also want to take magnesium, 250 to 400 milligrams per day. You want to be getting it close to at least 0.8 grams per pound of body weight, which is very important to build lean body mass. And that then in turn increases your bone density. And then finally, uh, vitamin K2, 90 to 180 micrograms per day is really important.